Hey, what's going on you guys? Today we got a special video. We're gonna be opening up a Legends of Johto pin collection. A lot of you guys saw this uh, for Black Friday deals and it's a pretty good price. So I picked up a couple and this one came kind of bent and damaged. So we're gonna crack it open, see what we can find inside here. And then I also wanted to showcase my Mew collection one more time because there's a, a trend going on on the Pokemon TCG subreddit that uh, people are showing off their collections. So just gonna go through these cards really quick. So you can see all the, uh, the updates and progress I've made because this collection has pretty much been growing every single day. So we got plenty of promos, non-hollows, hollows, reverses. So, some pretty sweet cards, and then beyond cards, we got a bunch of other Muse stuff. And honestly, this is more of a time for me to see what else I need to add to the collection. So, if you guys are a Mew fan, let me know. And if you guys do collect a single Mon, that would be uh, also pretty interesting. Like I said... Ooh, the clear card. Some tops. Some new ones that I've added. You guys have might have seen. But I thought it would be cool to put it all in one video. We're into the Japanese now. A lot of these are one edition. Or uh, similar artworks to the English ones. And... I think that's about it for the Pokemon cards. We got Mewtwo Strikes Back, Hollow, Non-Hollow, Muse. And then, of course, we have to show off the Korra Korra. And then just some other stuff here. Anything with Mew on it. Some Slabbies. And sorry for my finger. I cut my... Uh, my finger washing a knife today. Some plush, a little tiny plush, the Lego set, which you guys have seen. Tin, sealed Mew, deck box, got it all. So, got a couple figures, 3D printed Mew from Jess. Also have that in white, Mew pin. So, just so many Mews, honestly. So, hope you guys thought that was kind of cool because it's a collection that I've been pursuing even harder than the, uh, the sealed collection or any other singles. But let's see if we can get something good out of this box. As you can see, it's just three triple blisters in this box and like a thin sheet of plastic got the cardboard here so it's just cardboard and more cardboard and I guess this is what Pokemon company is doing now just lazily throwing in a few blisters and I do need the Blastoise evolutions pack so I'm glad I pulled that we're gonna set that one aside and then see if there's uh, anything good. Probably not even gonna mess with the Steam Siege cause I know you guys just hate it. So first up is the Suicune. Get the, uh, the pin. So set the Blastoise aside because I know I need that. Steam Siege, no one cares about you. Guess we can open up a Sun and Moon, why not? Next we got the Raikou. So Sun and Moon, 
open the evolutions, trash the steam siege. Check out that pin. And then we got the end tape as well. So it's just cardboard wrapped in more cardboard. Okay, there's that pin. So the Ente got the dogs. Put the Muse to the side here and see if we can pull anything on the first evolutions back. Love to get the Zard, even in the reverse would be pretty sweet. It's a code for you guys. And we'll try four and then electric energy. No, I messed up. So is that the rare? Well, <laughs> rip to the first pack. Did that one out of order. A non-hollow electrode. Boo. Okay, let's do one more evolutions. Get straight into the good stuff. It's another code for you guys. One, two, three. And we'll say fighting. Oh, I messed up again. Oh. Rib to evolutions. I'm tired of opening that. So let's try a sun and moon. More codes. And one, two, three, four. Electric grass. Okay. Anything? Reverse Growlithe. Oh, yes, a full art. Tauros. Sick card. Got a fractaling in the back on the texture. Nice card. Sweet. Out of the uh, the sun and moon. Might as well get the steam siege out of the way. I know you guys don't care about it, but we'll just burn through it real quick. Reverse Nidoran. Oh, a shiny. Yes. The Bisharp. This is the one I wanted. Oh my gosh, what a sick card out of Steam Siege. And like I said, it is the shiny because he's blue. And it's got this slash with the dual typing, which also shows it's shiny. So honestly, couldn't ask for a better card than that out of Steam Siege. Let's see if I have the sun and moon. So I already have these Steam Siege. So we could probably probably add this to the set and complete Steam Siege. So it's pretty cool. And then the Sun and Moon is not in here. So I mean, let's get. Let's get the Steam Siege. If you guys <laughs> really hate it, just click off the video. I don't mind. And like I said, thanks for watching. Always, you guys. Try three to the front. Electric? Nope. So. Ooh, the hollow hydrogen. It's pretty sweet. And I'm pretty sure I have the Sun and Moon packs as well, somewhere in here. Nope, not in there either. So let's check one more box. Yeah, I'm not sure. It's got to be in the last stack. Keep all these sealed packs in a booster box. Try to keep them organized. So yeah, Sun and Moon, we have all those already. So two more packs, you guys. We got the bad stuff out of the way. So far, one full art, one shiny. 
I'm not complaining. No card trick. Reverse Gigalith. Aw, oh, man. Boo. So, last pack, you guys. And if you guys made it this far, I appreciate it. Drop a like if you guys don't mind fighting. Oh, I think I messed that one up too. So, oh, nope. Reverse Grubbin. Oh, another one. Garbo. Well, that's it for this video. Couple decent pulls. Not bad at all. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.